What's good, what's good, it's the one and the only, but what do I know, boxing back at y'all with another one, bro. The boy Adrian Broner has called out Nate Diaz, man. As you can see on his Instagram account, he posted, he tagged him at Nate Diaz. You coming over to boxing, I'll give your ass everything you looking for, let's get it. Now, <laughs> it was all good just a week ago, right? Um, we all know AB was supposed to fight August, I think the 20th, uh, against Omar Figueroa. Um, he is now, you know, he, he pulled out the week of the fight due to mental health issues, so he claims, and I have to say that. Um, but uh, it, it sounds like to me, man, or it looks like Adrian Broner just wants a, a big money grab. I mean, he called out Floyd Mayweather and all this type of stuff. But but speaking on his his uh, mental health, let me let me show you guys why he might be having some mental health due to his own calls. Now, as you can see, um, this is this is on the the pitch that he posted with Nate Diaz. Um, the 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 name you see, Miss Louie Bags, that's the mother of his of his last three kids. Um, she she posted, "Give your kids that energy." I guess I don't know in, I, any. I don't know what that means, but um, she stated, "Give your kids that energy," and that's that's actually who he was uh, previously in a relationship with. He's in a relationship with a different woman now. Um, but listen, first and foremost, let me just say this. I'm not one to, I, I have grown to, like when I was younger, I used to always think like when, like when women say stuff like that, they're automatically right. But due to me being in certain, certain situations as well coming up, bro, I have learned that, bro, you can't always just go by what, 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 what the lady says, bro. A lot of times, bro, and not even just in that situation, bro, but in in every story, I've I've always realized it's more to the story than what one person says. Rarely will you find somebody that will actually actually tell the entire story, and um and and so I I don't I don't go by just like you know a woman or not or anybody else say or well, he doesn't he's not there for his kids, uh but they won't tell they won't tell the side that they they're keeping the kid. I've seen situations like this, whatever. A woman will literally post on, and this is not to bash any woman, but I'm just saying, um, speaking on this situation with AB, but a woman will literally post on social media, he doesn't see his kids and all this type of stuff, but she didn't post how she's keeping the kid away from this man because this man is in a new relationship and all this type of stuff. Like, I've literally seen stuff like that happen, so hopefully this is not the case with AB. Listen, bottom line, bro, Adrian Broner versus Nate Diaz, man, I don't see that happening. Nate Diaz does have a lot of boxing uh, boxing experience. He trains him and his brother Nate and Nick actually spar with Andre Ward a lot. Um, so he he does have experience. He does get some very good spar, sparring in there. But I don't, see a, I don't see Nate Diaz wasting his time on Adrian Broner. Adrian Broner right now looks like he's just Doing stuff to make get a paycheck, bro. I ain't mad at him, but AB has, you know, he's been out of the ring for what, uh, all, well, all, what a year and a half. So he has a lot, a lot to uh, stuff to to, to fix um, and heal from. Let me know what you guys think, man. Like, comment, subscribe. Would you even want to see this? Who would you pick to win? I mean, I, I do think that it'll be an interesting build up because Nate. I'm gonna tell you something. Nate Diaz is uh, one of my favorite. Um, UFC fighters, if if not my favorite, probably is my favorite. Besides my guy TJ, um, Nate Diaz is not. He's not, he's not one to just play no games. <laughs> Nate Diaz ain't gonna play no games with you. I, I love Nate Diaz. He keep it one hundred. Uh, he ain't gonna play no games with Broner. Like Nate Diaz ain't gonna go for all that shit talking, but Nate Diaz gonna mess around and slap Broner. <laughs> and ain't much Broner's gonna be able to do after that. Um. But I, I mean, again, Nate Diaz definitely has he he had him and his brother again. They spar with Andre Ward, so they do have um, boxing experience. Um, I, I think this makes for an interesting build up, but I, I highly doubt that this will ever happen. Let me uh, <laughs> let me know what you guys think, man. Like, comment, subscribe. Uh, who would you pick? Would you even want to see this fight? But what do I know? <laughs>